Hello there and welcome to today's video. So in today's video I'm doing some more fan art because I'm gonna go to a Youngblood concert in a few days and I just wanted to make one of those shirts again that I've been making for I think well not all of the concerts but a lot of the concerts that I've been going to this year I know I've not posted a video in a while, but I'm back and trying to post a little bit more regularly. Not sure how well that's going to work out because, as you may or may not know, I also go to uni and I also do other things on the side, so time is... Uh, quite limited so I try my best but yeah that might happen again but I really hope that I'm able to prepare videos properly so that I don't go another like three or four weeks or whatever without posting anything so for this drawing i actually did my sketch as you can see and i was going to do the drawing in a similar style to the other shirt designs that i've been making but i mean at least i wanted to have like proper clean like line art and stuff but Somehow, when I finished the sketch and I started to do like the cross in the back just to kind of map out how I want this art to look, I kind of really liked having just the sketch lines as like the actual line art because they are a little bit messy but like not too messy and i mean i'm not sure if you're familiar with youngblood i hope you are his music is great but he is kind of like i don't know a little bit out there like do you say out of the box is that a phrase i'm not sure if i'm making this up but you know a little bit more like not too calm and reserved but like a little bit out there and a little bit chaotic in a good way so i thought actually having the line art a little bit messy and a little bit unconventional if i might say so i just felt that it kind of fit this artwork and i just really was liking the look of having like sketchy line art so i just colored the line art in black because i had done it in like a dark blue and then i just turned it into black so that i have like proper line art kind of and then i started just coloring the art in and i did like a white kind of like background for youngblood like his portrait because I used like the pencil tool, if you want to say that. I'm using Procreate, by the way, and I was using the pencil tool, so I didn't want to have anything show through at the end if I like missed a spot or something, because obviously when using the pencil tool, it's not like super, super opaque throughout. As like the ink tools so I put down like a layer of white and then I colored like on top of it with the graphite pencil tool and I kept it black and white I also wanted to keep like the well it's not necessarily a quote it's basically just the album name I wanted to keep that black and white as well so that the pink in the background would pop a lot and I really like how it turned out and I feel like I'm not a big fan of pink I have to say it's really not my color but I feel like it's such an iconic like young blood color like when I think of young blood I instantly think of the pink socks and I felt like I just I just had to make it 
pink and I just really really like how the art turned out even though it's like in your face pink and I'm not a huge pink fan in this context I actually really like it so I hope you enjoy the video I hope you like the art and I hope to see you in my next one bye